Hi there, thank you for stopping by to share with Julie today. I hope you're having a fantabulous day today. And in this video, what I have prepared for you is a list of um, foods, plant-based foods, herbs that are really good sources of iron. And not only are they good sources of iron, they also provide the body with other needed minerals and also um, they have you know really good properties in terms of um, healing effects on the body and so um, I hope you like this list these are 17 sources of iron First up is Animo, also known as Guinean weed. Not only is it rich in iron, it is also used for cleansing the body of harmful organisms and also stimulating the immune system. Second is Blue Vervain. Blue Vervain is also used to soothe the nervous system, detoxify the body, reduce inflammation, stress and depression, and also protect the immune system. Third up is Burdock. Burdock is known as one of the best blood purifiers. It has diuretic properties also, which means it aids the body in removing toxins through the urine. Fourth, Kalaloo, also known as Amaranth or Jamaican Kalaloo. In addition to iron, it's also a great source of potassium and calcium. Kalaloo is rich in antioxidants and is a great immune booster. Next up is Chickweed or Chickenweed. It's an astringent. It has anti-inflammatory properties. It's used for kidney complaints and also to deal with issues of obesity. Number six is Concansa, also known as red willow bark or Concansa. It contains a high concentration of potassium phosphate also. It's anti-inflammatory. It's used to soothe mental cramps, prevent heart attack, reduce pains and alleviate headaches. Number seven, dandelion. Among its many uses include for cancer, liver disorders, diabetes, urinary disorders, acne, and jaundice. Eight, elderberry. Elderberries are also used to improve vision, boost the immune system, improve heart health, also for coughs, colds, flu, bacterial and viral infections. 9. Kale. Kale is also high in calcium. It's an antioxidant and also has anti-inflammatory properties. 10. Lamb's Quarter, which is also used for preventing and curing scurvy. Skin disorders such as vitiligo, stomachache, and diarrhea. 11. Lily of the Valley. Lily of the Valley is also rich in potassium phosphate. It is used as a diuretic, a cardiac tonic for heart failure, irregular heartbeats, for example, also for breast cancer, kidney stones, and addressing the central nervous system. 12. Purslane. Purslane is used to strengthen the bones and the immune system. It's also used for diarrhea and intestinal issues. 13. Sarsaparilla. It's a cleanser, a diuretic and blood purifier. It is used for treating kidney diseases, psoriasis and other skin conditions, and also rheumatoid arthritis. 14 is sarsal berry. It is the berry of the sarsaparilla. It has a very high concentration of iron. It calms the central nervous system, gives energy, and strengthens the immune system. 15 sea vegetables or seaweeds. 
For example, sea moss, bladder rock, nori, wakame, for example. These are rich in minerals and can be used to improve overall health and detoxify the body. 16. Stinging nettle. Stinging nettle is an astringent. It's a diuretic. It's used for issues to do with the prostate, such as BPH, urinary problems, such as infections and inflammations, and also kidney stones. Number 17, yellow duck. Yellow duck is a blood cleanser, purifier. It also cleanses the liver, detoxifies the body. It's used for STDs scurvy and respiratory issues. To go through the list quickly again, it's one animu or guinean weed, two blue vervain, three burdock, four callaloo, also known as amaranth or Jamaican callaloo, five chickweed, six conconsa, seven dandelion, eight elderberry, nine kale, 10 lamb's quarter, 11 lily of the valley, 12 purslane, 13 sarsaparilla, 14 sarsilberry, 15 sea vegetables or sea weeds, 16 stinging nettle, 17 yellow dock. So there you have it. And I'll put a link um, down below, maybe in the description. So you could um, just go to the blog and, you know, in case you want to just read through the list. And um, I hope you found it useful. Subscribe to my channel, like and share my videos. And don't forget, be the change you'd like to see in this world. Have a fantabulous day today. <laughs> Ta-ta.